What's up guys and welcome back. We're here in Westeros again and this time with the House Greyjoy. We are playing as um, today and we are looking at a beautiful shield wall with all the great golden krakens on. I am Pope John Paul and um, I am looking forward to this battle very very much. We are going to quickly wrap it up as you can uh, quickly fight this battle. I'm sure we will destroy the enemy and we are playing with a lot of um, reavers in this battle um, we have four units of reavers and we are again um, we have uh, a load of pike raiders as well that's really, that's really strange because like pikes are a weapon but it's also a place that they are from so it's kind of kind of fucks with my mind a little bit when I when I say out loud and then we've got a load of thralls which I'm guessing are just like the throwaway units they were very, very cheap, and they have got a lot more men. Then we have Yara Greyjoy and Theon Greyjoy, RIP um, to him. And um, we have Pike Raider crossbows and some Reaver longbows. And we are against House Greyjoy again. And, like, if you haven't seen Game of Thrones, it's a bit confusing to you. But there is, like, a Greyjoy civil war going on during Game of Thrones. And this is uh, Yara and Theon's uncle, Euron Greyjoy. Let's have a look at this guy. This guy... In the books and in the series is one mad guy. It looks kind of like him. Got a big sword. Really should be a big axe. But um, I'll let it off. Quick look at Theon. Bet he. Let's see how look good his model looks. Yeah, that, I'd say it looks very much like uh, Theon or Alfie Allen. The Nyara's. Uh, yeah, looks. I'd say Theon's is better, but that's not too bad. So um, yeah, we'll get this battle underway and we'll um, and we'll. See what happens. I'm gonna. So I've got my um, pike raiders and shield wall, and I'm hoping to to uh, use them to some great ability. I'm gonna move the formation forward. I think quickly. So we'll move it to about there. Some of the formations are a bit wonky, but hey, I can I can live with that. And oh yeah, I actually I don't know if I want you guys in this formation because you're gonna be really slow, and you're gonna slow down the. Everyone else, so get out of formation, just get to there. Who have we got coming out front? It's a very similar army. I think they've got a few spears, and um, but that's about the only difference. I wanted to show the spears off, but I mean, they look very much like the um, swordsmen, the Reaver swordsmen. These are the uh, or the Pike Raiders um, swords. These are just Pike Raider spears. They look very good though with their halberds. Oh, it's beautiful. This is really is a beautiful, beautiful mod. Here they come all charging. Oh! In comes the fire. Straight into the archers. And yeah, we have um, equal range, so there should be a fair fight in that in that sense. And here comes the um, the spears with the shields up. Oh, it's devastating. So I'm, I'm not really going to try and do too much micro. I'm just going to show off the mod and this battle and the faction. Because we've not really seen Greyjoy, the Greyjoys yet. So we'll get rid of that. We don't need that. We can just man manage the formations. I'm going to bring up these guys to about here. And you should be in the front because you're the rubbish units. What is dead will never die, as they say. And we have Theon. Theon's got to hold in the right flank. He's going to take on Euron by the looks of it, wherever Euron's ended up. Oh, they've got all their thralls on one side. So we could make a big push uh, on this side. There's no cavalry in this um, in this battle because the Greyjoys have very few cavalry. Don't don't have horses on the Iron Islands. Here come the uh, this. There's a force coming here. We've got reavers, lots of reavers. Oh, they're throwing axes. They are throwing axes. I want to see that again. This unit's the unit's going to be doing it. Oh, that's very cool. I, do, I need to get to a unit. I need to get somewhere that's going to do it. Um, you guys, charge in, please. I really need to see that. See them doing a... Can you do it, please? Please throw your axes. I need to see that. Oh, no, they're not going to do it. That's annoying. Anyway. We're winning there. I'm going to now do a big push over on this side. This is where we're going to see the, the axes going in. 
I can see it. Watch it with this unit as it goes in. Oh, that was devastating. There was that, um, that axe throw. Come on, boys. For me. Or is it only men that have no shield? I think it's only guys that have, like, no shield. So only, like, the thralls and stuff can do it, which is really annoying. That is... General is being... Is our general being attacked? I don't think he is. Anyway, yeah, they've now sent in, like, all their... All of their guys have gone in here. I'm going to bring up some more guys to help fight here. Yeah, I think... I'm not sure. Some guys can do it, but not such others. Very interesting. Yara, you might as well get in the fight. Um, and then just throw you in there. Really, we just have a big fight going on. We're getting very much outnumbered over here, so you need to come and help. This is Theon. Oh, Theon is very much beaten up. Can we have some uh, archer support over here, please, on this like big fight? But yeah, this is looking very, very good. Let's just get rid of that. So this is, I don't know, this is like, I guess it would be a battle like as if if um, Theon and Yara came back and invaded the Iron Islands when Euron was here. But they seem to always be in the same, different place, different times of the Greyjoy. Um, like factions are home to defend elsewhere. And most of the Greyjoys under Theon and Yara are dead now anyway. Um, the ones that are with Yara on the Iron Islands, the other ones that but Theon's like lost all of his to the, uh, the Whites. And then Eurons are all fairly healthy. Shooting down dragons. Sorry for spoilers, guys, if you've, if you've not watched it, but... I mean, you got to catch up. got to catch up with the rest. Okay, so you're doing that. Um, can you shoot at them? You need cavalry to charge down the archers. Well, I think most of the uh, Eurons' forces are dead. But yeah, this is going to be a very, very quick battle again to show off the um, Greyjoy faction. I should do large battles with this, and I would like, I may do that next time. Is that Euron I can see retreating? Oh no, Euron's there. Here he is. With his big sword. He's, can he take any names? He's surely killed a few guys. Yes, there we go. Euron killing another guy. Sure, he's, that's about like his tenth. I don't know. This, this guy can't avoid a fight. There, he's got another one take more names. You can't even tell who's who for like the Greyjoys. There's just so many. He's running. He looks like he's running. Go on, you're on. You can't die. You're my favourite Greyjoy. Even if you are a baddie. Oh, he's just standing off watching this guy. Oh. Oh. He is. He's lost his head. The enemy general is dead because he's, and he has lost his head. What a massacre. What a massacre. I mean, my army's in fairly good nick. I mean, it's lost about half its force. There we go, come on. One last volley. Send them off packing. Oh, it's brutal. Look at all the dead there. And there we go, victory. I would. I am still looking for people that would want to play this uh, mod um, with me. Because it's a lot more fun playing it with other people, as I found out with Scrim. Um, then... It is just playing against the AI. It's very, very easy. I may have to try and challenge myself and play that against the larger army. Because um, that will make it more fun. I might do another Greyjoy one because Yara's army was a lot, is a lot smaller than um, Euron's. And I might make Yara's a bit more elite. I might uh, just make Euron's a bit more, like weaker. But it's just like a lot more thralls. But there's a lot of... Um, yeah, a lot of them, basically. And just less experienced. But anyway, um, the thralls for mine... So I did fairly well, as did Euron's. I mean, those ones didn't. Those ones did okay. Anything really above 50 is pretty good for like a pretty crappy unit like the Thralls. And um, Pike Raiders and um, did fairly well in the Pike Raiders. Melee did... Uh, crossbows, yeah. Crossbows did well. Uh, main Swords did okay. 
um, archers doing very well, um, and then my most elite swords doing really well, and Theon taking a lot of names. Euron did not take as many names as, as, as Theon, unfortunately. But um, if you've enjoyed the video, um, please remember to like and subscribe. It really helps. I'm so happy we've hit 200 subs. Um, we did that over the weekend, really, and I'm really, really happy we've done that. Thanks for the support, guys. It's very, very much appreciated. On to 300, I say. So yeah, if you are new around here um, and you enjoy Game of Thrones, please do sub. There'll be plenty more coming. And if you want to fight against me on this mod or any other um, Total War, please let me know and I'll uh, see what we can do. Anyway, guys, until next time, see you guys later. Bye for now.